create and link nodes in Obsidian. Before you do that, you need to change one setting. We go back to settings and we go to files and links and we turn on this option to automatically update internal links. And I will explain why. So the easiest way to create a new note is to click on this button, new note button. Then you type in the title. Whatever the title is. Now there is a way to create new notes from the note you already have. Um, then you type on, in order to do that, you type on two square brackets and the computer automatically creates, the Obsidian automatically creates uh, the closing brackets for you. And you type the title of the new note. My thoughts on X. So this little window that says no match found tells you that uh, the note by this title does not exist. So you click return and then you simply uh, click away or click another return. And um, the feature that we turned on in the very beginning, live preview, turns it into a preview rather than a piece of code. So the piece of code is now hidden when you click away from it. So now you can click on it. And the minute you click on a title in square brackets, um, you create the new note. Voila, there's the new note. And you can type more of your thoughts. Now, um, you can also link to the node that already exists um, and that's even easier. So again, you type um, two square brackets and you start typing the title of the existing node. And it appears here um, in the search. And as you can see, it searches for individual letters, not for the whole word. And then when you click uh, on that um, line on the list, uh, it creates a link. So now again, when you click away, um, it becomes a link and you can navigate from one node to the other fairly easily. That's it.